You ready? You ready? Let's fight. Kevin Mohall starts up the two masters. Tektara from the blue trunks. Kerr in the white trunks. You know, Kerr used to have a right leg kick that was pretty fierce. Yes, he did. I don't know if he still owns it. Another concern is cardio. Does Mark Kerr have good cardio? We know he can sprint, but how long will that sprint last before collapse? That would be a big question, Mark. Kerr, single leg. Yeah. Taktarov in the guard, where he has spent a great deal of his life. Ooh. And Kerr looking to try to put him up against the fence. And yeah. This is really not what that's Tarif wants. A really dangerous thing to do against a Samo guy, raise one leg. Come on, Tarif! Get him! Get him! So these are the first five minutes that Tarif talked about getting through, which is the first round. Kerr is trying to unload a right hand. But Tarif does a good job, gets back to his feet. Nice quickness. I don't know if anybody saw it, but Oleg had his left leg up against uh, Kerr's bicep, holding him off. I think that's a really nice move. Kerr with a right hand. Oh, that was connected. I felt that from here. Well, Oleg knows where he is. Doesn't seem to be hurt too bad from it. And he He's bleeds. Cut. And yep. there is bleeding. The number one nemesis to Oleg Tektarov has been cuts. Looks small at this point. There's the leg. And will he get Ooh. it now? Whoa. Knee bar. Knee bar. Tektarov trying. Oh, it looks tight. Oh, he's got it. Oh. He did it. He did it with caginess. He was in a little trouble with the blood. And he did it with a submission. Man, was that quick. He doesn't need much of an opportunity to make a move, and he did it, and he got the win. Wow. It was quick. Well, he got Kerr to get up on top, and in an unstable position, he was able to shift to the side, secure the legs, and then he was able to find that knee bar. He does what he does best. And that is what these masters will do. They are dangerous, and took tar off, showing he still got it. Oh. Back to the bread and butter. He's an actor, but he acted like he was a heck of a fighter in there, John. Yeah, no, and I've been in his class, you know, under his tutelage. So uh, he trains that same kind of thing over and over and over. And, man, he's good at it. And he was worried about the early, the early part of the fight. He got through it. He did take that one big right hand. The cut doesn't look bad, though. And Mark Kerr with the great respect for Tuck. Hold him, and I'm not really, you know, doing anything until uh, he gets, gets tired. And um, maybe, um, in a way, my tactic kind of didn't work over here. I, uh, I missed one strong punch in the neck, and I was uh, pretty shaky. And uh, I was lucky that uh, Mark didn't want to stay on the ground. I guess uh, he was, you know, really... Uh, Surprised by his great strike, he wanted to repeat it, and then you want to fight him on the back, on his uh, on his legs. Well, and I prepared the trap for him, but nobody knew about. I uh, well, here it is right now. Describe it. Yeah, it's uh, I show like I, I'm turning my back, and usually when you get your back, guys go for the uh, choke, and uh, once you go for the choke, I go for. The